everyone. Whoa, I look so tan. Oh, now it's getting brighter. No, go back, go back. That was really nice. I think I went a little overboard on Bondi Sands yesterday. Anyway, hello. That was not the intro I was planning on doing. Hi, I hope you're all having a wonderful day. I'm back in my apartment, obviously. I have been quarantining or like staying at my mom's place. I've also been staying at Brendan's. I've kind of just been like back and forth basically. Um, basically just have not been at my apartment. <laughs> but I'm here today to film some videos. I have a lot of videos to be filming. I'm just gonna share them with you now so you can look forward to them. I also wanna do a good clean through of my apartment. Uh, I'm not moving back yet, but I wanna do a good clean through and then take inventory of what I have and then I'll do like a grocery shop and stuff like that. I figured I'd just update you on that. But there have been a few things that I have purchased in quarantine that I wanted to show you. I don't know what I just did with my hair. I just decided to ruin it. And do a little like haul what I've bought during quarantine that like don't really fit in any of the any in any of the other hauls I'm doing. I'm sorry, I was like super hangry like half an hour ago and I just inhaled a waffle because that's all I have at this apartment. And um yeah I'm just still coming and learning words again. So anyway I had a couple things come in in PR like Rimmel sent this Wonder Ink Eyeliner, and then their mini powder palette, which is an eye, lip, and cheek one. So that's pretty exciting. I'm gonna do an Instagram post about that. Um, and then Good Molecules sent their rose hip oil, which actually, one of my videos that I'm filming today is uh, I tried rose hip oil for one month. Um, I used the open formula uh, rose hip oil, but then Good Molecules sent this in. So I'm gonna just do, I think, a couple days of trying this and then throw it into the video that I'm gonna be filming. Um, because I think that's pretty cool. So anyway, but my Sephora order. <laughs> so I actually placed two. The second one has not come. I ordered this on the 21st of April and it came last week. So, and that was like May 7th, 6th or 7th or so. So they're pretty backed up. The other order that I did, I ordered um, my face wash, which is the fresh soy face one or cleanser. So I've actually just been cleaning my face using my makeup remover cleansing balm, which I don't think is good, but I just, I don't want to get into another cleanser, have my face break out and then switch back into my old cleanser and then have a breakout again. So I'm just leaving it like that. I'm not wearing a huge amount of makeup. I actually look like I'm wearing a lot of makeup, but I'm not. And I'll show you my cream products in a video that I'm also filming later today. <laughs> so anyway, um, there's just a lot of filming going on. Um, so I'll show you what I got. My First thing that I went on to purchase is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. I think everybody knows about this cream. I missed it so much during quarantine because my hands are so dry. Like, not that I never washed my hands beforehand. I just, I'm washing them a lot more. I'm using more hand sanitizer when I'm going out in public. Um, I'm like using a lot of cleaning products and like wipes and stuff like that. So my hands have just been super dry and like I tried Aveeno, I tried my St. Ives cream, and nothing is as good as this. So I finally got my hands back on it and everything, and my hands are so happy. Um, yeah, I love it. It is so good. I Also, they were really bad that they were a different color, like my hand was a different color than my arm, and it wasn't even fake tan. It was just because they were so dry and cracked and everything. So this is fixing that. <laughs> Um, and then another thing that I needed was my um, retinol. So this is the Ordinary Retinol. I did a video, like a review on it. I did one month on retinol and then my six month update on retinol and how it has changed my skin for the better. So I ordered another one of those. Um, it probably takes a year to use up this product um, or just under a year. Uh, so it is very good for them. I think it's only like nine, nine dollars, nine or eight dollars. So very happy about that. Um, this was a need because this is just go watch the video because you can see how it has changed my skin and my acne and all that stuff. Then I treated myself with something that I've been wanting for a really long time, which is the Hollywood Contour Wand by Charlotte Tilbury. Um, I have tried this, like used it and stuff like that, and I am obsessed. I, I One of my big goals this summer was to only use cream makeup products because I find that powder doesn't really sit well with my drier skin. So using the cream products and just using one brush to blend it all together, 
is amazing. And then a couple little things that I grabbed, um, or I just added onto the cart because these are amazing and they're on sale. So they're $4. It's the Sephora Watermelon After Sun Mask. It instantly uh, soothes overheated skin, immediately and dura durably hydrates dried out skin. Uh, summer skin is super quenched, soothed, and is glowing tan will last even longer. But anyway, for four bucks, I stocked up on this, and then in my other order, I ordered two more. So I'm very happy with this. This is just one of my favorite, like, I think summer in the sun go-tos. Uh, just when you're laying in bed and you're, like, soaked in aloe, and then you have this on your face. It's great. Um, I'll show you the other things that I got. Oh, one. Oh, whoa. <laughs> I apologize there. Okay, so I've been wanting to get on a multivitamin and all that. Whoa, okay. Someone is in a pissing mood. So anyway, I wanted to get on a multivitamin. This, I want to try the gummies. These are so good, but it smells legit like candy. And it is so nice. Like in my morning, I like have my toast with my banana and I'll have some fruit and my orange juice and my coffee. And then I just have my two little gummies on the side and it's just a treat that I finish my breakfast. So I'm glad that I'm like in the routine of wanting to take these and it tastes good, but it's good for your immune function, bone health, metabolism and healthy skin so so anyway yeah i don't honestly don't know what else there is to talk about because now i'm gonna go film these videos and yeah hello oh, that was weird <laughs> it has been a couple days slash a week back at my apartment i well for you guys i haven't left i'm back i moved in last night why is my camera not focused there we go um, yeah, I moved in last night. This was my first time sleeping in my bed for like since Easter. That's it's crazy that time has just flown by. I feel like I've hit all phases of quarantine. I had like a week where I was like working out and eating healthy. I had a week where I just ate like crap. I had a week where I purged everything and like cleaned out my wardrobe and my makeup and all that stuff. Um, and then I had a week of like online shopping and buying everything. <laughs> anyway, the fun has now come to an end, I think, for that. I've moved back in. I'm starting to get more of a routine back into my regular life and stuff like that. Um, I'm starting work up again this week, which is nice. I'm going into the shop, I think, twice this week, which will be good, all that stuff. But anyway, I just wanted to vlog today because today is such a gloomy gross day and instead of wanting to sit on the couch and like binge modern family like i did the other day i wanted to get things going i have no food i also need to des like i desperately need to clean this apartment it's just so gross and not up to the way i like it and all that stuff so i'm gonna be doing that today um i have a few haul videos to film that's why i did a little bit of my hair and put a little bit of makeup on and all that stuff so i'm gonna be doing that but yeah i figured i'd want i want to vlog i'm in a chatty mood and i don't really have anyone to talk to so <laughs> <laughs> we're hanging out today and cleaning. I made a list of things when I go to the grocery store so I don't forget. I have a lot of healthy food on here so I'm not going to really get anything crazy um, and all that stuff. So yeah, and I also have to go back to my mom's house to do a load of sheets and towels and then I'm gonna upload my rosehip oil video. So that will already be up by the time this video is up so go check it out. I did a month on rosehip seed oil and uh, all that so you can go check out my results and thoughts and all that stuff i did it the same format as i did my retinol video so yeah um i just wanted to come on quickly i made a little pile here i did an airy haul and it was a fail and a half oh my god place an order and didn't really look at the titles of ordering it i ordered high-waisted underwear like, let me just flip you around here, hold on. This is what ha most of them look like. Literally, gotchies. <laughs> like, it's just ridiculous. I thought this one was gonna be super cute, but it's just very high-waisted and big. So, that was a fail. I'm just gonna have to wear them to bed, I guess. I guess they'll be comfortable, but I don't know what I was thinking. See, this is what I thought I was ordering. This one, was normal. This was like a cheeky one or like hipster I think it, the thing was. Which I like sleeping in these. It's very comfortable and like it's super soft. But like 
whoops. Anyway, and then I got some normal underwear over here, and then I got this t-shirt, which is I wanted to get for the boat in the summertime, so I can wear my bathing suit over it but still be covered, but it has an open back and it's all tied and I think that's really cute. So just a plain crop top. And then I also got these sweatpants, which are super nice, and they have pockets. So yeah, they uh, were pretty good. I'll link them down below and I'll link the, high, the hipster high-waisted ones so you don't buy those. Unless that's your style. There was a lot of them, obviously, since I got three. And I actually got a white one, but I can't find it. I think I left it at my mom's house, just on the floor there. That is, uh, there's a lot. So maybe they're popular, maybe people really like them, but I don't know, I don't like seeing my underwear through my jeans or like above it, I don't know. <laughs> but I'll link them down below and I'll link these ones as well. Just wanted to share that quickly. <laughs> oh, I also got the other half of my VIB Sephora haul, or sale. I just kind of threw them in this corner that I need to go through. But yeah, I got it, which was nice. I ordered another uh, face mask. I tried, I thought this was bigger for some reason. It's the Laura Mercier uh, Hydrating Silicone Free Pure Canvas Primer. Um, so I'm excited to try that. It's just very small. So I'm going to put that in my primer drawer and all that. I don't remember picking this up in my samples, but I'm happy about it. It's the, how do you say it, Cordeline? Ooh, my hair. The Cordeline uh, Vino Pure uh, Skin Perfecting Serum. I got this as a sample from one of like a event I went to or something like that, and it was like the nice like small version of it and I loved it. It was so hydrating. My skin was bright and nice and just looked perfect. And then anyway, so I went to go buy the full version. It was like $90. I was like, I'm gonna wait. <laughs> oh yeah, and then I also ordered my fresh face cleanser that's in my bathroom there. I used that last night. And I also redeemed 500 points and I got the Drunk Elephant Skins Happy Place. I'm not a huge fan of the polypeptide cream. That I found actually broke me out, so my friend really likes it, so I'm gonna give it to her. And my other friend likes the cleanser, so I'll give them those, because I'm not a huge fan of them, but they like it. But I more did this for the mini um, makeup cleanser, and then the body lotion, just for when I'm taking, like, up to the cottage, or, like, if I'm not sleeping. Like, if I don't need to bring my bigger stuff. So let me open it and see the size of it. Okay, well, first of all, this packaging has all this, like, confetti stuff in it, and now everything's black and got all over my blanket. But wow, this stuff is tiny. Like, the package is this big, but the thing is this big. <laughs> so yeah, I got the makeup cleanser, or the makeup remover, this cleanser. It says it's a body cream cleanser, so maybe I can actually just put that in the shower, but I already told my friend to give it to her, so. Um, and then a body lotion, and then the little peptide cream. So wow, those are some tiny products. Definitely not worth my 500 points, but whatever. So anyway, <laughs> that is that from the Sephora sale. I bought that stuff. Um, now I'm gonna go film my Abercrombie & Fitch clothing haul. I got some cute dresses for summer, so I'm excited to wear them and put them on. I feel like I'm gonna be very girly this summer and just wear lots of pretty dresses and everything, so yeah. So I did my tan last night, so it doesn't look that bad in my try-on portion, so anyway. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'm going to film that video, then I'm going to head over to my mom, upload that video, then I'm going to head to the grocery store, and then I'll come back and I'll hang out with you guys, and uh, we're going to have a clean and grocery haul party, I guess. Yeah. Hello! Oh my goodness, I, I had the windows down, I was driving home, and it's just destroyed my hair. I'm back, it is 2.37. I'm starving, but I made it through the grocery store. I figured I'd do a quick grocery haul. So I finally have food again, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna quickly put these away and um, make some lunch. So yeah, first up, OJ, gotta have that. Then I got some eggs, obviously I got some chips. Um, and then I got hamburger buns and regular bread. So that all goes in there. I got milk. Then I went to Costco uh, last week with my mom. Oh no, I went with my brother. Oh no, two weeks ago I went with my mom and I picked up tortilla chips. So I got that. I couldn't go to Costco without getting some guac, so I got some of that. Oh my god, I don't want to put- well, I got some cleaning the counter so I can put this on. Then in bag number one, I got some marble cheese. 
some shortbread cookies, <laughs> uh, sweet baby lettuce, I got some broccoli, uh, I got two oranges, actually I'll just keep them all in this pile, oranges, um, got some carrots, a lemon, some bananas, apples, and I got some Swiffer uh, wet mops, I needed that. Oh, this one's heavy. Oh, I broke my back doing that one. Then I got peppers, I got a red and green one, celery, a cucumber, which is open. I'll probably cut that and nib off. Got some ginger, garbage bag, dishwasher pod, some elk crossing, my favorite ice cream. So good, it was on sale. I got some frozen berries for smoothies and stuff. Um, and sangria. <laughs> I got some yogurt, I got peach, and this uh, vanilla lavender. I was actually looking at one recipe on Pinterest and it was lavender cake. And I thought it was kind of interesting. And then when I saw a la or vanilla lavender yogurt, I was like, huh, maybe I'll, I'll eat that. So grab some of that. Got a lime from my gin. Toilet cleaner, lovely. Red onion, some teriyaki sauce for stir fry later. I got a thing of Cliff Bars because it was on sale. And lately I've been eating a lot of them and just grabbing them like at the gas station or at shoppers and stuff. So I figured why not grab my own. I'll stash a couple in my car. So that's that there. I think that's everything. Oh yeah, and I also stopped by my mom's and I picked up my herbs that I got at Costco last week. So I got some, this is pretty good, for 10 bucks you got lemongrass, uh, rosemary barbecue, basil, uh, pesto, and thyme, or lemon thyme. So that's pretty good. I'm gonna go put them out on the balcony. I wanna get a tray that like folds over the railing there so I can put them in and it just kinda like hangs over so it doesn't take up too much space. Um, but I'm gonna put them out there. I want to do a lot of work to my balcony, but I just don't know where to start. <laughs> That's the thing. I want to go into the store and pick things out. And I want to go to Home Sense. I want to go to Marshalls and get like cute little cups for my gin and, and all that stuff and, and some serving platters, but I don't want to order them online. Actually, Fortino's had some cute ones. They had some pink and blue uh, plastic cups and I liked them. So I was thinking I could get some at HomeSense when it opened. So last resort, if HomeSense doesn't open for another month or so, then uh, I'll just go and get them at Fortino's. But yeah, that is my haul. I have some frozen chicken in my fridge, so I'm just gonna eat that this week. I'll probably do like chicken breast tonight and then I'll like barbecue some chicken, then I'll do like stir fry and chicken salads and stuff like that for the rest of the week. And then probably on Friday, I'll uh, just make burgers. So yeah, that's my plan. Now I'm gonna put this all away, make myself some lunch, um, and then get to cleaning. Cause it's later in the day than I anticipated of getting everything done. Uh, I had to stop into work and do a, a couple things, um, just submit orders and stuff, but yeah. <laughs> for not doing a time lapse of me cleaning and stuff like that. I kind of just got in the zone and didn't feel like bringing out my camera and all that stuff to just do shots of me cleaning. So anyway, it is now almost six o'clock. I'm just finished. I did my bedroom. It looks all clean. It looks so nice and it's just bright. Uh, my jeans are still drying, but yeah, I'm just so happy. The bathroom is clean. That's nice. Also, look at this nice hand soap I got. I really like that. That was one of my quarantine purchases. <laughs> Splurged a bit because it was like $17 or $16, including shipping for that. <laughs> but it was, it's all good. But yeah, we're all, all clean, which is nice. That's nice. And then you come into the common room and it's clean. It is so nice. So yeah, I haven't really organized my desk or anything, but my printer was just on my floor because I'd sit and do work there. But I figured it's nice near my desk, so I put the printer over there and all that stuff. For the time being, I haven't really been using my um, standing desk, so that's just been on the floor there. But it's all clean and the floor is all clean. Look at it reflects, it's so nice. Hang and now the counters are all clear and cleaned off. It's, it's nice. I'm, well, yeah, I was got in the zone. I've been listening to Sinatra.
just finished a meeting and I decided to lay on my bed while listening. I didn't have to contribute anything in this meeting, I just needed to be there and talk, or uh, and listening, I mean. Oh man, I'm tired. Three o'clock. I'm finally, well, no, I have a couple emails to do, but I think I can do them later. Yeah, I'll do them later. It's so nice outside. It's kind of chilly. I just took the garbage out just before my meeting, and uh, it's a bit windy. I think it's only 16 degrees or something like that. But anyway, I want to get out of the apartment because it is, well, because it is super nice. But yeah, around 5 o'clock, it's going to be warm at 14 degrees. Friday is supposed to be so nice. It'll be 21. I don't know if I want to go drive to my mom's and just kind of lounge around in the backyard with my dog or if I want to just go to the beach down here but it does look really windy and all that stuff so I don't know if I want to go down there yet but yeah I don't know what to do I don't understand yeah I figured I would just come on here because the last footage that I filmed was just me getting up this morning and then I went straight into work and it was just kind of boring uh, of me doing emails and kind of just in meetings and stuff like that so it wasn't really all that entertaining and all that stuff. Tomorrow I go into work um, for the first time in a really long time so that should be, well like in production I mean I was there yesterday but yeah it should be interesting getting back into that routine and all that stuff but we'll see but yeah it is kind of nice maybe i'll just go to my mom's just to kind of get out i'll go uh wash my car and all that stuff um just to kind of still be outside but also productive and not just lying there so i think you're gonna do go do that this is my thing because i want to bring you guys with me but it also means i have to bring my big camera and it's so heavy that i don't want to like I do <laughs> I want to but it's just it's a lot of work and I don't it, yeah I just I've been looking at smaller vlogging cameras with like the flip screen like obviously the G7X everyone talks about that and it's really good I was looking at the Canon M200 and then I was looking at a Sony one and all that and they're not terribly expensive for what you're getting and all that stuff so I've been looking into it but I just don't know when to buy it because I kind of want to do it in store and not just order it online sort of thing. They have one at Costco. They have the M200 at Costco and I was looking at that and it doesn't seem too bad. Oh, I don't want to answer this. Let me know if like you guys vlog and all that stuff like what cameras you use because it would be nice especially when I do like my come shopping videos and stuff like that if I actually have a smaller camera that I can take into the change rooms, I can take actual shopping with me, I can vlog more, um, like when I go for walks and all that stuff, because it's not the same on my phone. I'm not a huge, I'm, I don't like the quality of it, it's not that great and all that, so I think I'm gonna invest in that, I just don't know which one I need to do more research on it, so let me know what camera you guys use. But yeah, I'm gonna stop blabbing and uh, get outside, it's super nice. So anyway, thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm gonna be vlogging more and all that stuff, which is nice because I'm back in my apartment, which is... Nice. If you really enjoyed today's video, uh, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you won't miss out on any future videos from myself. And yeah, I'm going to get outside and enjoy some sunshine. Um, definitely if you have the chance, go outside because the weather lately is, is going to be really nice the next couple weeks. So yeah, and it's really bright in my room. So yeah. <laughs> anyway, look at the light though. Like, it's so nice. Anyway, well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!